Welcome to Vlogmas Day 6. It is Wednesday. I have one class today at 5.10. And right now, it's almost 2 o'clock. Yep, 1.45. And I've just been hanging out. I just made a little bit of a lunch. I wouldn't even really call it lunch. I'm just having some macaroni with butter and salt and pepper. Honestly, really basic. Because I am running low on some food. Um, Homework-wise... Don't have anything due today, <clears throat> but I am gonna do some work later. I'll probably go to the library again and hang out and do homework. But tonight it is Riverdale at eight o'clock. I think Alexa's coming come over. I'm not sure, we haven't talked about it yet, but she usually comes over on Wednesdays to watch. So maybe she'll come over later i realized that the library is always packed at this time like the best time to go is like three four o'clock so i think i'm just gonna skip the library do my homework here no big deal and i'm gonna be at the library plenty of times um next week during finals so actually speaking of finals today is my last day of class actually so i don't have classes thursday friday next week is finals which there are no classes except you know when you take your final so i only have like one in class final next week and it's on wednesday so one week from today i'll be done with class so right now i'm just gonna like get a little bit ready i'm gonna like fix my hair a little bit put on some makeup just because i look like garbage and then I'm going to film like a little bit of a mini video for you guys for the vlog and it's going to be pretty exciting. But first I'm going to do my hair really quick. So I'm going to put it back in a ponytail but I'm just going to like liven it up a little bit. I'm going to put on this product from Dry Bar. It's the Triple Sec 3-in-1. So this texturizes, amplifies, and refreshes hair. So this is what it looks like. I got this on Black Friday. I've used it a couple times. It's pretty good. It's not quite like dry shampoo, but it just kind of makes it a little bit more, you know, a little bit more presentable. I like how it makes my hair feel. If anyone's wondering where my uh, velvet scrunchies are from, these are literally my favorite. I don't wear anything else but these. These are from Urban Outfitters. I have like two sets. These ones are more like the pastel colors, so like this more yellowy, green, purple, pink kind. I just got these recently. I'm not sure where the other ones are, but I have more like earthy tones. This one, like a gray, the maroon one, which is my favorite. Um, they're pretty inexpensive. I think they're 12 bucks, which isn't bad. And I get like a pack of six. So Urban Outfitters, please come out with more because I'll buy them and they're great. So yeah, I'm gonna put on some makeup. I'm not gonna bore you with going through all the steps because I did that in Vlogmas Day 1, which you should check out. So I did like a little everyday makeup routine. And then I'm going to film the little video that I was gonna tell you about. So let's do it. I finished my makeup and it looks a little bit more intense than usual. I actually put on eyeshadow and eyeliner, which I never do. But I used my oldie but a goodie palette. This is the MAC palette from the Cinderella collection. Some really cute shades in here, so. I used to wear this I look like all the time. So for this part of the vlog, I wanted to share with you guys my 2017 Christmas wish list. So I don't usually make a wish list, um, but this year I was like actually wanting a couple of things. So let me share with you guys what I put on my list. First thing on my list, I'm gonna put them right here. So mom, if you're watching this, which I know you are, here is my list and I'll send it to you, you know with the links and all that. So the first thing on my list are Hum Vitamins. So I've been talking about these for a while now. I've almost bought them like 20 times. Like I always look at them, I always look at their website. And the two that I really want are the Daily Cleanse and the Red Carpet, I believe that's what they're called. So, so they're just vitamins, you know, take them every day and you know, they just help with your skin and your hair, nails and everything like that. And I've been wanting them for a while, so I would definitely like the two vitamins. Next thing is a pretty big one. I really want to see Harry Styles in concert. So he's going to be in D.C. on, I think, June 25th, 26th. And I would really, really like to go see him. That would be just a dream, honestly. So 
Carrie Styles tickets are definitely on there. Uh, the next thing is an iPad case. So I have the iPad Pro, the 12.9 inch, and it is massive. Yes, it is, I know. But I have this case. I got this last year for Christmas, and this case it has been through a lot. It has many flaws in it. So there's this piece right here that like sticks out like that. There's a big scratch on, on the back um, over here. And this part is missing over here. There's just a lot. So this case was great. Along with this case, it came with this keyboard attachment. So I used this so much last semester when I was in um, one of my classes. I took a lot of notes on this and it basically just clicks in like this. Now it's attached and now it looks like a computer. I would definitely like a new case. Um, I don't have the perfect one in mind. This case is by the brand Zag and I don't even know if they make this anymore, but I cannot find it anywhere. But that is definitely a big one. I would really like a new case. Next is star earrings from Urban Outfitters. I've been eyeing these for so long and I just have not bought them yet. I just love them so much, so they look like this, obviously. And they're like hoop earrings, but they're stars. So I would love those, because I wear my hoop earrings all the time. And the star ones would just be, this would be a little extra touch, you know? Next, I have a pair of shoes. I love my Air Force Ones, and I love my Adidas. So yeah, I basically just love any kind of sneakers. But I have these ones in mind. They're from Poshmark. If you don't know what Poshmark is, is basically you can like sell your clothes or your shoes or bags or anything on an app. So I have these pairs of shoes in mind. They are like gray with a little black on the back and a cute like gold swoosh. And they're really cute. So those are definitely on my list. The next ones are... Just kind of a backup i really like the first ones more than these but these are just like nice maroon red statement little um shoe i have my blue adidas the gazelles i love those and they're definitely like a nice pop of color these would definitely be a nice statement shoe as well next i have a neon sign now i've been wanting a neon sign forever to put like right over here i think yeah right below the happy birthday sign or replace the happy birthday thing because I had that when I turned 21 which was in September but I've just kept it up or I would like to put it above my bed maybe so I've always wanted a neon sign I picked some out from Amazon I found like a really cute star one and a really cute moon one I would definitely love both together but if I had to choose I think I'd pick the moon one so that is on my list and they're not that expensive from Amazon actually so I would love those and they're like powered by USB which is kind of cool. Next I have a wildflower case. Now wildflower has to be my number one brand for iPhone cases. I've been buying them forever and let me show you just a few of my favorites. I had the iPhone 6 forever and that's when I bought my first case which is the marble one which I don't have with me because I left it at home. So now that I have a new phone it's bigger so I need a new case. But here's some of my favorites. This was like one of my very first ones. It's just has this cool design on it with the cute little studs, which was like their signature thing back in the day. Sorry, I think I just saw my enemy. <laughs> Next I have this one. This is the Hotline Bling one from, you know, the Drake song. And back when like this song was really popular, I definitely got the case. So these are the two that I always loved, and the marble one, of course, and I have more at home. But the one that is on the top of my list right now is this star one. It's like velvet, it's really awesome, and I think it would look so cute on my phone. The only thing is that it's always sold out. It was back in stock one day, and I just like could not buy it because they're $40, but <laughs> that is definitely on top of my list. The next two things are makeup. Like I said in my other vlog, I was using this foundation forever, the CoverGirl one. And don't get me wrong, it's really nice. I think I would just love to try a new one. And the one I've been wanting to try forever since it came out was the 
um, Too Faced Born This Way foundation. I hear really good things about it and I would love to try that. And the next thing, my last thing, is a new Anastasia Brow Wiz. Now I've been using the pomade forever and I love it, but I just love the Brow Wiz for like a more natural look. So I would love the Brow Wiz again. So yeah, that is my Christmas wish list for this year. Just a couple of things to give my mom a little idea of what I would like for Christmas. Right now I'm going to paint my nails because I'm feeling a little festive and I am going to paint my nails. This is like my nail polish collection. Not as big as the one at home, but I see this really nice red and a really nice glitter might do like an accent nail. I'm gonna use this really bright red. This is from Butter London, one of my favorite brands. This is Come to Bed Red. So that is the color. And just for a little pop of Christmas flair, I'm gonna use this glitter polish from Revlon. And I'm gonna put this on my ring finger. I'll catch up with you guys when my nails are all done. These are my finished nails. I have the, the red with the cute little accent nail with the glitter. So this is my finished outfit. I have this sweater from Goodwill, Victoria's Secret Langs, and Air Force Ones. So it is four o'clock. I'm gonna leave in about 30 minutes to go to class. I just got to my car. But look how beautiful this is. It's pretty windy, I hope you can hear me. But OMG, it's so pretty. But it's really cold, so I gotta get in. Oh my God. I was gonna walk, but oh my gosh, it's just so cold. Anyway, so I am going to drive to class right now. I could not have gotten a better parking spot. I'm very happy right now. So. All right, now I'm gonna go to class. Oh, it's those bitches from math class. I hate them. Oh, I bet they're parked right next to me. Oh, I hate them so much. I'm so glad I never have to see you ever again. It's so cold. I just got out of my last class of the freaking, freaking semester. I'm so happy I never have to go back to that class. Oh, I'm so cold. Okay, I'm gonna drive back. All I want to do is go to McDonald's and get Coke, but uh, I really shouldn't. <laughs> no, I'm not going to go. It's fine. But I'm going to go back to my apartment, and then I'm going to just get in some comfy clothes. And I'm going to wait until Alexa gets here. So it's almost 7. She's going to come over around 7.45, 50-ish. And then we're gonna watch Riverdale. Oh, I just got back. I feel great. I feel awesome. The only thing that can make this better is if I plug in the Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. There we go. <laughs> and one more thing. These lights. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. A perfect sight to see. So, I totally forgot that I was actually gonna make pancakes for dinner since I don't have any real food. I would eat this, but I really wanna make pancakes. All right, I'm gonna make pancakes now. More updates to come. Okay, I have my first two in the pan. I actually added some blueberries on it because just to spice it up. So my batter looks good. These are cooking away. Almost ready to flip. Oh yeah. Here we go, here are my finished pancakes. My blueberry pancakes look really good. Um, they're almost vegan. I just put a drizzle of honey on top because I don't have any syrup, but I use like vegan butter and vegan milk, so almost vegan except the honey. So I'm gonna eat this now and I'm gonna wait until Alexa gets here. All right guys, so it's 8.30 now. I'm halfway through Riverdale. Um, there's no sign of Alexa. So she didn't end up coming, I guess, but whatever. So that is it for today's vlog. I really hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe for more, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.